Last week saw American Horror Story co-creator Ryan Murphy reveal the title of the show's upcoming eighth season, American Horror Story Apocalypse. Here's what we know so far about the eighth season of American Horror Story. It's gonna be a crossover season. Ryan Murphy revealed in June that American Horror Story season eight would be a crossover of season one, Murder House, in which a family moves into a haunted LA home. Welcome. And season three, Coven, about a group of girls who attend a special New Orleans Academy for young witches. Season one concluded with the family's newborn child being taken by their creepy neighbor, played by Jessica Lange. And in the season one closing scene, we discovered the child had murdered yet another babysitter. Now what am I gonna do with you? Throughout season three, the young witches of Miss Robichaux's Academy fought off evil forces like the Minotaur, the Axeman, and the corrupting seduction of becoming the next supreme leader of the New Orleans witches. Season eight's promo image is indicative of the crossover. With season eight being a crossover of seasons one and three, it makes sense that the first image from American Horror Story Apocalypse combines a newborn baby with an evil demonic force. Even the posters reminiscent of promo images for the show's inaugural season, which showed the infamous Rubber Man, an embodiment of sexual rage, reaching out for the unborn child in a sleeping woman's belly. In the newly unveiled season eight poster, which has the same red and black color scheme of season one promo images, a supernatural creature is reaching out for a child. Season eight is set in the near future. The title of season eight, Apocalypse, provides a pretty good hint that the season will take place in the future. Back in January, Ryan Murphy did indeed confirm that's the case, but we aren't talking about sci-fi future. We now know that American Horror Story season eight is set approximately 18 months in the future. This marks the first time a season of American Horror Story is taking place not in the past or the present. Much of the American Horror Story cast is returning, but there are a few new additions. We know that American Horror Story regulars Sarah Paulson, Evan Peters, Kathy Bates, and Billy Lord are all returning for season eight. One new addition to the cast is legendary actress Joan Collins, who will play the grandmother of Evan Peters' character. Another new addition is Jeffrey Boyer Chapman, an actor and model known for the dark comedy series Unreal. It's been hinted that season one stars Dylan McDermott and Connie Britton could also be coming on board for season eight. As for the casting question in the back of all our minds, there's been no word yet as to whether Jessica Lange, who appeared in the first four seasons of American Horror Story, will be returning for season eight. Ryan Murphy told Entertainment Weekly in June, you will see so many fan favorites return that you'll feel like it's the love boat. It's rumored that Evan Peters will play a gay hairdresser in season eight. Ryan Murphy has said the actor, who just ended a stint on the critically acclaimed series Pose, will play a comedic hairdresser. Will Peters be playing gay for the American Horror Story audience? The tone of American Horror Story season eight will be much different from last season. Murphy revealed that season eight will be more fantasy inspired and heightened, saying, it's not necessarily as real and grounded as the past season. We're sort of getting back to Asylum and Coven. That's the tone of it. Expect a big twist in episode five. We can expect some big surprises in American Horror Story season eight, according to Murphy himself. It's a season unlike anything we've done because there's a big hook to it, he says. There's a huge thing that happens in episode five. American Horror Story Apocalypse premieres September 12th on FX.